Hello everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Um, if you're new here, my name is Catherine and on this channel I share my love of journaling and planning and stationery. And today we are going to be doing a weekly setup for the last few days of January into February. Um, and I have a dual system where I use both the Hobonichi Weeks and the Hobonichi Cousin for my regular daily um, planning and journaling. And so I will just be setting up the weekly section of the Cousin plus um, a little bit of the daily pages and then the weekly section of the Weeks. So I think we're going to start with the cousin because this is faster and it's also the more fun part um so what i did in january was i had this midnight's kit from um the coffee monsters co and i was using it throughout the entire month um so it all, like all of the spreads look relatively cohesive because it's from the same kit and so i think i'm gonna do that again for february and i'm just trying to decide if i want to do the last three days here still part of the memories kit um or like midnight kit and then start with the new kit here or if i just want to do the full spread um i still do have a little bit of the stickers left like barely any actually um yeah so actually let's just start it's fresh here and um what i picked out for february is the icy wonderland icy wonderland kit oh my god from tcmc i actually have two for of these kit um they're both like partially used and so i thought i would just use up the rest of this for this month and then i also picked out this tcmc winter critters washi tape for this week i like to have the same washi tape for an entire week so as you can see in my daily pages um this was the first week no this was the second week Okay, the first week I didn't have washi tape, but then the second week I used this office washi from TCMC. The third week I used this magic washi from one, Every Minute of Story, I think. Um, and then now, last week I did not put down a washi. I have some back journaling to do, but for this week, I think I'm gonna go with this. Um, so let's just get started. And I apologize for any traffic noises that you hear. I do live next to a busy street. So. It's not perfectly even, but it's fine. gonna put the corresponding washi on these pages okay. and then I noticed that it's only been a few weeks but because I keep placing the washi in the same place of every page um this specific part of the book is starting to get a little fat and so i think i'm not gonna put the washi here at the bottom for every single day of this week oops that's off it's fine um oh shoot damn it this is the wrong week this is last week ah 
Okay, I ripped the page a little, but it's okay. I'll deal with that when I back journal. Mm. Okay, let me move this. I think I'm gonna put it in the middle of the page. Here. So the washi has been placed on every day now, um, just randomly across the middle of the page. And then back to the weekly section, I'm going to set this up. So I already have a to-do here. This is from the Midnight Kit. And I think... I have these weekly habits that I track, so I'm going to put down these dot stickers for that. One, two, three, four. And I think, um, I am also going to use this habits sticker for my habits. So those are my daily and weekly habits that I track. And for here, this section, I'd like to mark off nine to five for when I work. So, so I'm gonna take out my ruler. Okay, and I think I will put down one of these deco stickers. Um, I think this one. Let's put it at the bottom here. And I'm also going to use one of these stickers for more deco. Okay, so that is my Hobonichi Cousin weekly setup. Um, at the top here, I put down like major things that happen, um, like positive things that happen. So I already filled that in. I have Hades Town on Friday um, and Book of Mormon on Sunday. And so that's it for this. Now we are going to get into the Hobonichi Weeks. So let me just put this stuff back. Oh, okay. Back to the side and now, okay. So the setup for my weeks is a little slightly more complicated. Uh, I have a lot of trackers, like tons of trackers. Um,
And here. <coughs> and oh, I guess I should explain. Um, so basically, for my cousin, um, I basically do daily planning and journaling in here. And then in the weekly section, this is like time tracking. As I go through the day, I will write down what I did in each hour. Um, so for example, I guess here um, on Tuesday, as I was going throughout the day, um, I will I wrote down like what happened. So I woke up around 7 to 7.30 and then I did some journaling after that. Um, and then when work started, I spent about two hours on my regular reports and then I spent like four hours, I think, one, one, two, three, but no, three and a half hours underwriting a deal, etc. And so this kind of just helps me keep track of my time. It's not where I plan. Um, and so I use this, the Hobonichi Weeks to do my weekly planning. Um, and then I translate that into daily tasks in my cousin. So I have a to-do list every day. Um, yeah, that's like a simplified explanation. So here, what I did on the left column, I just split it into three rows. Um, basically from a previous week on the sidebar here, I do stickers. Um, they're color coded for the type of workout that I do. Um, so here we have the color codes and I split it into three columns because these are like three major areas that I want to focus on. Basically, one is self-studying computer science. I put down the topic that I studied every day. So like on the 16th of Tuesday, no, Tuesday the 16th. Oh my God, I can't talk. Um, so on Tuesday the 16th, I finished Python module three um, and then on the next day, I did the test for module three. And on Friday, I started Python module four. Um, so that's the first column. It's computer science related. The second column, um, I didn't do anything this week, but it is related to my journaling slash planning content. Um, so TikToks, Instagram, and YouTube. Um, this week I didn't do anything, but you can see, for example, the first week um, I did quite a bit of work. Um, for example, I finished writing in my 2023 cousin, like I backfilled as much as I wanted to. And then the next day I filmed the flip through and I also um, posted a reel and then after the next day, I also posted another reel. Um, so yeah, that's that. And then the last column is content for my main channel where I post vlogs. Um, right now it's only vlogs, but I'm hoping once I catch up with my footage, I'll be able to also do some studio vlogs and art content and stuff. So yeah. Um, this week i did quite a bit for that too i was editing a vlog from august 2022 so here you can see i edited and posted my virginia vlog and then here i did my rough cut for the august 2022 vlog and then that day after that i posted it and on saturday i refined the thumbnail for that video um and so splitting it into three columns like this just helps me visually see like what is happening for each respective thing on each day, as well as the days when I was able to be like super productive. Like here I did so much studying and I also did quite a bit of editing and versus here I did nothing for all three days um, or like all three things. And then it also lets me see like it's, virtually impossible, especially on a work day, for me to do something for all three things. And so um, as long as one of these is filled out per day, 
I'm happy. And if nothing is filled out, I like to go back into my Hobonichi cousin to see why was it not. Like, why didn't I do any of this? Did something come up? Did I have plans? Like, did it go out with friends or something? Or was I just lazy? Um, and I didn't feel like doing anything. So I was extremely unproductive for no reason. Um, so yeah. And then over here, we have a bunch of trackers. Um, we have social media trackers, workout trackers, um, nutrition slash diet trackers, and then sleep, calories, computer science studying, and steps. Some of these are a little bit redundant, but I don't know. I kind of like the visual aid of seeing information in different formats. And then down here, I have goals for the week. I break it up into study, video editing, and reels. Okay, that car finally shut up. So now I'm just gonna finish setting up this side. Um, and yeah. Two, four, six, Two, four, six, eight,
Okay, so this is the final setup for my weekly section. Um, I'd left a few blank spaces because I'm not sure, or like I might add more videos and reels for me to film slash edit as I come up with ideas. And then over here, um, I'm gonna do just a slight bit of decorating. I usually decorate at the end of the week um, based on like where I have empty spaces. But I think I'll put something maybe here. Um, let's see. And then this girl sticker, she's the last one that I have from the pack. So I definitely want to try to use up this sticker. And okay, I think I'm probably not going to get much done on Thursday and Friday in terms of video editing because Thursday I have dance class after work and Friday I'm going to see a Broadway show after work. So I think it's pretty safe to... Put down a sticker for these two days um and then over here i have some stickers from pa paperica shop i totally butchered that um but i think i'm going to use this there's green and yellow which matches the green and yellow here and i'll just put it down at the bottom here um, and that will be all of the decorating for now. So yeah, that is my final setup for the week. Um, this is what the cousin looked like, and this is the Hobonichi Weeks.